you're going to add the rolled oats into a blender or food processor and then pulse them into a fine oat flour. Then add in the medjooled dates, almond butter, maple syrup, vanilla, and salt. Blend everything together until the sticky dough forms. If you're having a hard time blending, you can add a tablespoon of plant-based milk in order to help blend that together. Now we're going to blend in a half a cup of chocolate chips with that dough. You're going to use your hands to blend that together. Press the dough into a foil lined loaf pan or you can use some parchment paper instead of foil. You're going to use your fingers and try to get it as flat as possible. Place the pan into the freezer for 30 minutes to set and during the last couple minutes of them being in the freezer you're going to melt your remaining chocolate. You're going to pull the pan out of the freezer and remove the bars by use, pulling on the sides of the foil and then we're going to drizzle the chocolate over the bars and add some of your favorite toppings such as walnuts or sea salt, whatever you desire. I just did just the plain chocolate. If the chocolate doesn't set instantly when putting it on the bars, you can put it back in the freezer for five to 10 more minutes, and then you can go ahead and cut them up and enjoy them right away. They're super duper delicious. 